Sean Mourinho here, BSN TV. Uh, this is the last game of the season this evening. Has been at the showgrounds in the league after the cup final was postponed due to uh, other circumstances. Uh, we have you okay? Go ahead. We have uh, with us here uh, the uh, management and the uh, life and soul of Regan Homer, or sorry, Harry Homer, I should say. Excuse me. I have Rob Duddy with me here, and I also have Mitchy. Uh, Mitchy. Obviously, I know that, but uh, listen, champions, champions league finalists. Uh, Two cups, done the treble, you know, so just before I bring you in, Rob, like, Mitchie, this is definitely the best I've ever had, isn't it? There's no doubt about it, like, you know, that, uh, you know like, I'm sort of stuck for words as how to praise you in the way that you deserve it, you know what I mean? You've come here tonight to play all Saints, to try and maintain, you are league champions at the moment, but to try and maintain an unbeaten status throughout the season, you've done that, you've won 2 one coming back from a 1-0 deficit, what do you think? Yeah, it's brilliant, it's brilliant for the club, it's brilliant for the lads, um, as Rob said, before the match, lads, just be proud of yourselves, what you've done this season. And he said also after the match, uh, fantastic season, you know, um, unbeaten. And uh, got through the league, unbeaten is an achievement of its own, you know. Uh, to win two cups uh, and won the league, you know, has been a fantastic season for us. The best I've ever, you know, experienced at the Homers, and I've been there a long time. Um, won trophies a lot of years, but uh, this season with the guys, first class, attitude's brilliant. And, Everyone about him just brilliant, and of course, Rab and uh, got them going, training, um, getting them going, left it before the match and all starts, it's, it's, it's been brilliant. You know, and uh, to put that into words for myself, you know, like Mitchie, I'm not going to stretch too far, because hey, you can run as good as your last game really, as with my attitude in football, you know what I'm going to tell you, if you get anything like that there next season, you're going to be terribly hard stopped. Rab Dolly, uh, first season manager for uh, the Harrival Homers. You came, we've talked about it throughout the season, through the nights that you've won trophies, cups up here, uh, cup nights that you didn't win cups, uh, you know, like, did you think this was going to end like this? Do you know, you know, on such a high, such a great season, you know what I mean? You know, when you came here, you wanted to, you obviously knew what you were looking for. You hoped that the players were going to be capable of giving you what you wanted. You've got it served here, Rob, ten times more. Came here, uh, start of the season, Sherman. I had great team left of me. I feel like and heard a great team. Um, Jason Jordan done a great job. Wa well before him done a great job. It's it's been this hasn't been a fluke. It's been building for the last three or four years. Uh, Junior Shield semi finalists, Junior Shield finalists. We all know what happened there. Junior Cup finalists, and it just had to push on this year. We've say we lost a few good players there towards the end. Of, well, end of last season we lost Sudie Miller, we lost John McDowell, we lost Phil McBurney, and. They they would be replaced hard to replace in any team, but McCallard another couple up and they've served us very very well and it's 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 been beyond all my expectations to be honest with you. But we've got to run together at the start of the season, and I knew once we got to run together and we got the games in, we would be hard to beat. And once we had the momentum, there was no there was no looking back for some of them boys. There was a great bunch of guys to manage. They're not hard to motivate. They show great fight and determination even in training. And it's, I tell you, it's an absolute pleasure. Pleasure. I notice every time I have covered the Homers this year, you don't have to ask them to get changed. You don't have to ask them to go down and do their uh, betting training before the game, their warm up. You know, they're out, they're doing it. Somebody's wee, uh, what you call the wee man there that runs the, 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 the wee budgie. That boy stood out of mind for me this season. There's been quite a few players in your team that stood out of mind, but you see for authority and for the likes of, you know, the likes of winning uh, attitude. You know, there's no doubt about it. He is the boy that has been the spiral behind the wheel. He's the boy that's doing the shout in the middle, you know what I mean? So, I'm just going to end it and say here to all you viewers out there, it's been fantastic for me this season. Uh, I have loved and I've enjoyed doing this and long may this last. And my guys like this here, it makes it a lot easier. And I, I congratulated us the other day in a personal uh, obituary which you had, or obituary which you had uh, come back to me and says, thanks very much. You earned that. You didn't. You didn't get that out of Noel Reid. You earned that. You have by far been the best team in the certain morning League this season. And Sherman Reid on himself, BSN TV, congratulates the Homers. Good luck, Rob. Good luck, Mitchie. And long may it last. And I'll see you next season. I'll be at your dinner for a bit of crack. Good luck, lads. Thank you. Thank you.